But before we attach it, we're going to move forward. <laughs> What Phil Rubin levels require investigation? And? If it rises by more than five. Oh, yes. If it rises by? By more than five. So if it spikes to five, investigation, 12 point nine. What? It was in 24 hours. Okay, so like the baby just born. No, well that anything above 12 months. So 13 and above, investigate, period. Yeah. But if they're, and all of a sudden they're at 11, you would investigate. Four hours, before 24 hours, then no, Within 12, 24 hours. Just within a 24 hour period, if you test it and test it, like five, investigate. Yeah, before, before 24 hours. So that's within, so it's born, then 24 hours. Is that what it's saying? Because it could be like day four and five. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah. That makes sense. In a 24 hour period. Nice. Um. All right, what are expected findings of the neonate? The mother was addicted to cocaine. Oh, um. The baby? Shaking? Shit on him? All right, under any choices. Morgan, tremors, irritability, bradycardia, hypertension, flaccid muscles, exaggerated stock holders. Okay, so uh, it's not really flexing out. No. Mm -hmm. Class muscle? Yeah, I mean, they're pretty good. The irritability and the. Yeah, it just says, in the newborn nursery, it's like, who was born. When was the irritation? It's the same. What, what is different about a preemie versus a preemie with cocaine? Yeah. Okay. Why is it not excessive? Not excessive. This is not too excessive. It's not cocaine. Well, I think it's not currently on cocaine. <laughs> Off. No, hold on. If you're coming off, okay, you're going by yourself. Weekend. Yeah. yeah. Hey, so I think it would be exactly. I'm, I'm putting it yeah. okay. All right, hypertension? No. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah
actually
Yeah. It's a baby game period of time. No, it's the first one. Because you want to get as much crust milk on there as Keep as much crunch as possible. So, yeah. I'm just reading about it and I saw something about, oh, I'm on it, that's why. <laughs> Glucose water feeding should not be offered to the infant because this practice may reduce milk intake and can bother. Uh, newborn. I just read about it though. I know, it's a book. There's more evidence of jaundice in infants who are breastfed. Breast milk jaundice begins to be seen about the fourth day. Most supply develops. The newborn usually does well, but it's given an early onset of jaundice of the breastfed infant. Inadequate infant suck at the breast causes jaundice and necessitates an increase in breastfeeding. Um, in late onset jaundice, the breast milk itself may inhibit conjugation of bilirubin and therefore formula may be substituted 24 to 48 hours to reduce bilirubin. So it depends on if it's onset or onset. Late onset, you want to put in formula. Interesting. Did it say exactly? Breastfeeding should be initiated within two hours after birth and should be done every two or three hours thereafter. Supplementation of water does not reduce hyperbilirubinemia and should be discouraged because supplemental feedings of water do not promote stress. The infant should not be fed less frequently. It is not necessary to stop breastfeeding cover. Early discharge of the newborn necessitates follow-up visits within how many days? Serum bill or one? Uh, should we decide be two days? Three days. Oh, it's three or two days. Yeah, two days to check for the room because it's Serum bilirubin typically what? I'm going to get a wrong word in question. I'll say that right. I was so ready for the study for the respiratory alkalosis, metabolic acidosis, all that. Yes? Didn't get a single question. The fetal, what was the thing? Because they don't know how to do it. The oh. No, the, the from last last test, the stuff like the fetal ECG monitor. Fetal monitoring. I oh, yeah. so hard. No, I, I, I was saying stuff in my sleep. I was saying stuff like no sense. I, I saw that and I was like, they're not gonna ask that yeah. next. I just flipped the page. No shot. I was like, no so I studied the last test. I studied the ECG fetal and rebirth trajectory. And it was, I was so mad. They did ask a question about it on the retest, but it was the broken one.
Tom Faulkner was hilarious. He was like, all right, the last class, they were heavy on ECG, EKG scripts, so we're going to go heavy on EKG. I'm like, yeah, but their test isn't the same as our test, so they're obviously going to be the exact opposite. Of so the thing is, is it's the person. Back a little bit. What's the test? But then you have the quizlets. But then you have the quizlets. So nobody in our class is making them. I'm running off old points. Nice. What happened to Becca? Becca used to like making the materials. He got a car. Oh, sure, we have a car. I'm the biggest one. I literally will sit out and I'll wait for my prey. I'll be like, waiting for Martin or Bella or something. I'll be like, can I get around? Are you showing people who don't drive or don't drive much? Um, I should have the car then. Do you have a car? Oh, you don't have a car either. Oh, I'm sure there. There's a direct correlation of people who are extremely unhappy and do well on tests. <laughs> <laughs> you have one get kicked out of the army. What is GPA? I don't get kicked out of the army. No, I mean me. Uh, yeah, I keep my high GPA just to get. Good <laughs> job. <laughs> I don't know. It should have been a 76er. Carl all seems pretty happy. <laughs> Is this still Is kickboxing? Yeah. I know, I have not seen him. And I'm like, we're supposed to study together, but he's been, he's gone. Right now. I noticed that females exist. That's an Asian. I don't know, in his case, he was raised a little innocent. Yeah. In Vegas? Or his mom and his parents, yeah. Him and his brother. I realized his mom was I kissed my school teacher on the cheek. It was really weird. Bob was in kindergarten. But even then, I was just like. I remember the kid. Uh, this, uh, she lived down the block from us, but she was like, uh, like in high school or something when I was like in elementary school. She's like babysitting me. And I ended up kissing her. Uh, um, <laughs> I was a favorite of my sign in elementary school. Uh, I remember Mr. Girl, she was like, so she was like, what? And I was like, what? Wait, hold on. Exactly. Oh, Re -re -re oh, yeah. Change the conversation. Yeah. Get, change the conversation. No, no, no. Wearing, 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 wearing. Wearing. New conversation. Yeah. I'm, <laughs> Why are you thinking about critical thinking skills? So, guys, you guys, he really, he was doing so good with his inside thoughts. <laughs> so, oh, really, y'all spent like how? Clearly, I said a different story, different <laughs> subject. Tell me about your. Um, no, but he didn't tell me about it. It'll warp. It'll turn around. Make you mind. Story, bro. You can tell your story on the bus. The time Not when. The time I was there. Mm -hmm. Not the time I was there. <laughs> <laughs> it just took a turn. Y'all are going to be like, oh. No, I'm laughing at something else. I mean, it's like a 50 50 shot. 
I literally, I would use that. That's actually beautiful. I know. How old is that phone? What? I'm sorry. I used to use it from the bottom of my heart. It's like this in my hand. I'm sorry. The tiniest phone I've ever held. Dude, I, I have no one. I literally spent so much on Bill. Hot. It's, it's like overheating. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll give you $1,000 and I'll go get a new phone, okay? Then you guys can. I'm done. Come on. This is the first thousand dollar phone, a second thousand dollar phone I ever bought. And that's just my life. What carrier do you have? For me? Yeah. I don't have the carrier that gives you a new phone when you upgrade. It's just the one that's like the. I get the no you still didn't answer me what carrier. I have T Mobile, but I have the cheapest plan. That I have. So if you switch to. Verizon, they'll give you a, a new phone. Yes, sir. But and attitude. So a lot of them, like when you get like a new automatically upgrade to you, it's included into the plan. Like they'll they'll get it down the line. They'll get that money back, but which makes sense. But uh, I don't want to do that. I want to get the cheapest plan possible, and it's cheap. How much is your plan? If you don't mind me asking. For me, oh, uh, like I only pay. I pay 120 bucks yeah. a month. Uh, sorry, not a month. A year. A year. A year. 120 bucks a year. Oh, I'll I pay that. 120 bucks a year. I pay so, yeah, so $120 a year to be on my parents' plan, and I pay my parents. Oh. Yeah. So I pay $10 a month. So I get a really good plan if I. Your savings account better be like. Dude, it's. It is. So I've been putting like automatically half of my paycheck goes straight into savings. So I've been saving half my paycheck. I. To my parents and my sister. So my, it's like a little, it's just a little hundred bucks for my sister because she buys groceries. Yeah, I did that one time. She said You're she way more. Why I'm are you buying your back. sister? How old is your sister? My sister, she's 26, but she also, like, she. School in Italy and everything there is super expensive. So. But she, whose choice was it to go to middle school? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 you convinced her to go to Italy? Italy. Getting, she's not getting, like, trust me, she, you know, we're family, so it's like, it's, no, it's not, I get it. stuff because my sister has asked, okay, she asked me to help her pay her rent this one time because she's bad with money, and so I, I paid her, I gave her $200, and she's like, I was like, pay me back, take out the money, so she gave me back, and then, like, three months later, she was like, I need rent money again, and so I was like, okay, it's $200, like, you're my sister, I got you, don't. She has not paid me back in four months. I, every time I text her about it, you used the word "don't worry about it," and she said, "She said don't worry about it." The day, like a month after, um, she paid her rent. She got a new tattoo. I was like, "You're joking." Oh yeah, that would burn me. Yeah. What's crazy? She makes more money than me. So my sister. Well, there's yours. Right. My sister has one uh, job as tutor, and she can only she gets paid like. Uh, under the table, but there comes risk with that, so she yeah. like, and it's really hard for her to like. She's in she medical like, medical school. Yes. Why so she it? has to buy her own. She can, like she doesn't have enough time to have a full time job and be in medical school. I mean, so investing in your family. Something positive. Yeah. Fully no, we're we're mm -hmm. pushing. No, well, I will. I'm telling you, I'm talking about how to do today. Yeah, you know, when she makes that doctor money, you better be like, hey, remember? Here's your interest. Here's what you owed me, plus the 30% interest that I put on there. My sister, we're really good with each other. Right? We take care of each other. My so parents, not so much. But like supporting my sister. 100% my sister and my mother for yeah. five years straight. And then yeah. one day. The audacity to ask me for a dollar um, certificate. And I was like, I can barely afford food right now. Absolutely not. Four hundred dollars is an expensive. Yeah. And then she went off about how I spend my money on me. <laughs> I was like, oh. So I immediately sat down, made her apply to jobs. I got her her first job. She was crying the whole time, and I was like, you're gonna put it at Walmart. You're gonna put. Because I was done taking care of her. 
I was, yeah, and now I got her first job. She worked. 31. She is smart. Like, she's in school. Like, the Army's paying for her to go to school. Like, she got a scholarship through the Army. My mom didn't have so many jobs. I was, I, I was working under the counter at a butcher shop for two years. Well, I was working under the counter at a doctor in place since I was 12. I was one of my parents. My parents were big. My sister. My mom got my sister's first job as a helping her at her animal farm school. My mom. Cheating. Cheating, right? My mom gave her her old car when she needed a car and then she crashed that car and so they were fine to buy her a new car <laughs> i know my mom actually like hooked me up hella all right look i'll pay for half your first car so whatever you save i'll double and so then i just started to work and just put money away a lot of people See, do that my, uh, my dad offered me the same thing but he's you know i'm really he's cool so, like, yeah. so everything that I've done, I just bought 2023. Uh, I didn't want that. Well, I bought safety. There's a different perspective. If I can afford it, which I didn't have when I was growing up, if I can afford to, to provide, then I'm going to provide. Because you have to see this vehicle, so I can't control that person that's going to crash Back in control. No, no. Just boys? Okay, then there. Huh? That's smart. Yeah. But the car is a mine. This is not a good thing. Oh, no. <laughs> mm -hmm. See, my parents did that to my sister. Yeah, my little brother. brother to figure it out. My little brother and my mom just, like, bought us for a full fucking trip. Yeah, I've had a job before the internet. That is insane. No. Yeah, right. Oh, my God. It's because he's the baby. I mean, granted, uh, he's the baby. my son told me driving my daughter to her ballet thing. Oh, oh, yeah. There's yeah. Just, yeah. Just, just to be clear. Uh, and you're babysitting. My first Damn, it is. It's just 13. It's a 1995 square box Chevy that only had like 100,000 miles on it. Because it was this old dude, and his dad died, and it was his dad's truck, and it just sat in the driveway. I bought it for like seven years. Fixed it up a little bit, and it was going to be. Yeah. Now, then I got, so my first car was nearly exploded on me. Oh my god. And then. I just, I just got the, I got the perfect name for you just down there. And I got the Hyundai Accent, and that car can't drive more than 30 minutes at a time. But he got me from home to work, and that's all I do with it. The rest of the time, I so, uh, so, no husband, and he drives me around. That's, that's nice. a month? No, the only reason my mom let me use her car was she was like, you're not driving my brand car. Absolutely not. Mm -hmm. And I was like, but mom. You work nights, so that means when you come home, you would have to drive me to school instead of going to sleep. And she there we go. I knew that would come in handy. <laughs> Let's see what you said on top. Please stop giving me your words for everything. Next driver. I know. You know what? I bought that Ultima from Dude. And he was just like, and it was like a nice car. I was like, why are you getting rid of it? Like it had my high mileage. But I was like, why is he getting rid of it? And then I tried to go 80 miles an hour on the highway with that car, and it nearly exploded on me. I was like, oh, that's why he's getting rid of it. That's why it was so cheap. They're under your leg, guys. <laughs> oh, you have it. So what'd you put in the group chat? What? Oh no, this that was like hey. <laughs> my messages are just now sent in. Oh. Oh yeah. I was so confused. <laughs> oh. Bro. Message just sent. Grab my AirPod case. I was like the one. I was <laughs> it's like it's me. right there, dude. Yeah. It's wrong with you. Note this. If we send you a message, it's like <laughs> two days later. Yeah. My own. You're gonna be taking the test and. What the hell's that? She has no PT tomorrow. <laughs> Saturday morning. Really? 120 of the high. Insane. She's actually insane. She's like the full. She's exactly what I wanted I think to be. My husband's mom. She's just so brilliant. She's like a badass nurse. She had midlife crisis and she drove late and she bought a really fancy car. I mean, it looks like something from a futuristic movie. And she's just like smoking cigarettes and just like. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. You used to wear nurse and smoking cigarettes and cool. 
There's the, there's the thing like, you're a nurse and you've seen what it does and you're still smoking. My mom had a massive stroke. She was in her early 50s because she was a nurse who smoked. Yeah, she, but she, I don't understand how that woman, she's like 70 and she's like still like pretty healthy. I'm not, I'm not advocating for it, but I'm just saying, I don't know how she I lost like all my family to smoke. Oh, yeah. I'm very small. Oh. She just looks like, like, she, I don't know how she's. She smokes a pack of hay. She's tiny. Yeah, she's. She's just kind of plain like her. And she just. I swear, it's something about you really, really. really away away. Away. <laughs> <laughs> you just like, then you're just short. Like, you're just forever short. Dude, my. Wait, my so wife spoke about my <laughs> wife's grandfather is 75 years old. She drinks nothing but straight regular Pepsi. She's like this tall. She only eats potato chips oh, and my like she eats the worst food. She won't eat anything healthy. She's never eaten can't touch vegetables. She only eats like the worst processed stuff. And she's got like a perfect bill of health. And I'm like, it's because you're so tiny. I think survival in you. Like, it goes in and out. It just has nowhere to. When you use that tiny privilege and live forever. Live forever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to talk about how young she is. Yeah. She acts. All the world's oldest people, the record, they're always like five foot two and shorter. I'm just saying. Oh, dude, she'll be. I'm, I'm, like yeah. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, they were like. Oh, my God. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yes. Italian, that's not going to be going to be. I know, we had a conversation class that day. Yeah. Yeah. It was never a normal day. Yeah. Drink it, drink it. <laughs> I thought Italians live in Italy. Italians live in here? Italian <laughs> 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 If you're an Italian, you live in Italy, you live in Italy, you live in Italy, no, I knew I knew I shouldn't have gone. I was like, looking at you, I was being suspicious. I don't think there is. On cigarettes, <laughs> wine, and bread, man. No. There's no protein in their diet. They don't believe in meat. Dude, literally all that is is protein. Pasta, bread, wine, in that pasta, cigarettes. Man? Carbs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That has meat in it. Like meat is like it's a like garnish. It's <laughs> like a little shaving of chicken. <laughs> You'll get fish. There's a lot of fish in Look, there. Sorry, we're not all in keto, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Where's this in Definitely not the Italians. They could survive. I don't know. I've been waiting here for Grayson's morning, bro. She's like, oh, you know, a steak. Yeah. Yeah. They eat bacon. Yeah. They even put bread in the bread. Yeah. 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 Y
monasteries in Korea for the money. For the, how the monastery is. Yeah. That's all they do. That's yeah. all they have is to pray to God and make. But and they have never had a bath since their production in the early 1900s.